George, Jacqueline over at Steamboat Motors. Look at this cool 392 Wrangler. Um, obviously looks familiar to you because you inquired about it. I am just going to walk through and make sure everything looks good to you. Um, you probably know more about the vehicle than I do, um, but I'll just start with the exterior. Here you have that upgraded um, hood. Okay, everything is color matching, which I really like, um, including those gold um, front tow hooks. Wow, way out of the game. Tow hooks on the front, you've got that bumper with your Rubicon um, package with the upgraded wheels, tires. Um, it is an unlimited, so we're gonna get that nicer interior. Um, you do have those black door handles and black mirrors. Um, all doors and top come off, obviously. Um, you've got the gold tow hook in the back. Sensors, okay, spare tire, um, obviously your backup camera. This bad boy has only got 2,000 miles on it, I think like 23, 2,900 on it. Um, so everything looks good. Um, you're gonna notice the best part about it is the uh, top matches the color of the car, okay? Normally it's black. So color matching door handle, or color matching top. Um, we've got the back hatch here. Okay, it's got all of our snow inside of it. Sorry about that. Um, but it's got all of our mats back here. Got a nice little storage bin. Um, this will hold all of your nuts and bolts, um, which is really cool. I like that Jeep thought about that. Um, it looks like you got a 12 volt back here. You'll see where that roll cage is, which is color matching as well, um, compared to your hard top, um, in case you wanted to pop that off. I will say this is a flaw of Jeep, is um, people will stuff things in the back um, that scratch it. Okay, oh, there's your Alpine. So it does have that upgraded stereo system, which is ridiculous by the way. You don't know what you got until it's gone. Um, so we'll go ahead and shut all of that up, get into the car. Sorry, it's freezing here. Nine degrees, negative 14 this morning. Um, okay, so you're gonna notice all your window controls are on the center of the vehicle and not on the doors so that these can be removed. We do have that gold um, stitching, which looks really nice with this color of Jeep. Um, you got your speakers integrated in that roll cage. Um, those are just as is warranties. Um, your two USBs and an 8C outlet, okay. It is in pristine condition back here. Nothing going on. Okay, beautiful leather interior. Um, we've got your automatic lights, love it. Okay, it does have the manual seats, which is in all Wranglers. Nice badging in the seats. Goes really good with that color. Everything looks really nice with the color. I'm gonna go ahead and slide in here. All right, so definitely listen, because this is like the best part of the Jeep. It sounds amazing. All right. So everything will pop up. Really nice, like 2,902 miles. You're gonna notice on the steering wheel, we've got a minus and a plus. Those are our paddle shifters. Um, it is loaded to the gills. By that, I'm meaning you've got all your safety features, which is your blind spot protection, which is in the mirrors. Okay, look at all the snow, it's beautiful. Um, so in your mirrors, you have all the blind spot. We've got all your Bluetooth and menu controls here on the left-hand side of the steering wheel, and then all of your cruise control on the right-hand side, um, which includes your adaptive here, okay? Once we get into the touchscreen, you have that nice new touchscreen, all of your manual buttons, and then we'll go through all of your off-roading options. Um, so in the touchscreen, we have AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio. You also have Bluetooth, um, auxiliary, USB 1 and 2, okay? Um, then we have our climate controls, which is a dual climate, so both driver and passenger can have their own climates. Okay, um, then in our controls here, we have heated seats for both driver and passenger and a heated steering wheel, including your backup camera, which will show you to that hitch. <clears throat> Navigation, that is not in all cars, um, so that's nice that this already has that in included into it. 
Um, once we get into our manual buttons down here, you're going to notice you have dual climate controls here and here, um, as well as your heated seats, heated steering wheel for both driver and passenger. Okay, it is going to give you a front defrost, rear defrost, your fan controls, volume, and tune. There is a screen off button um, to dim that screen, which is actually my favorite. Um, sensors and um, traction control. Okay, all of your um, window controls are here in the center. I already explained that a little bit. 12 volt, your auxiliary and first USB. Okay. Um, you have your locking front and rear, um, as well as your sway bar axle ratios. And then your all of your auxiliary is going to be off to the right. That would be for upgraded um, aftermarket features such as light bars, so on and so forth. Okay, so that's all Rubicon. Um, and then we also have four wheel high auto, um, and then four wheel high part time neutral and a four low. Um, not all Jeeps have the auto four wheel high. Love it. I think that's awesome. We're also going to notice you got that park reverse neutral drive and that manual mode with your plus and minus, which is also in your um, pedal shifters. So got that regular e-brake, um, old school, love it. Um, two cup holders, like I said, you get all your badging and stuff in your seats. It does have a nice two-story center console with your second USB. Okay. So everything looks really brand new. I mean, there was a couple scratches in the back, but that's a Jeep thing. Um, if you have any questions or I missed something, please let me know. Everything looks good on the Jeep. Um, I'd be more than happy um, to go over any more details. Give me a holler on my cell phone, Jacqueline at Sumo Motors, 970-778-2116. Thank you so much. Talk to you soon.